welcome to our channel so in this video we are going to discuss about fajans rule if any one of you need to get a simple and easy format notes for this topic simply you just go and check out the description or else comment section where i have given the link to download pdf of this topic. fajans rule basically deals with covalent nature of ionic compounds and you just remember that no bond is 100% ionic and no bond is 100% covalent that is it is just like some bonds are predominantly covalent while some bonds are predominantly ionic in nature and now what does this rule says is this rule says that covalent character increases with increase in the size of anion and that can be written as covalent character is directly proportional to size of anion and we know that here directly proportional to sign represents that when the size of anion increases then automatically the covalent character of a compound increases i will show you an example later now let's go with one more point of this fajans rule this rule says that covalent character increases with decrease in the size of cation and that can be written as covalent character is inversely proportional to size of cation that means when the size of cation is decreased then the covalent character of the compound will be increased so let's take examples to understand fajans rule example 1 so that is we have nacl and nabr sodium chloride and sodium bromide and now among these compounds we have to say we have to just find out which one is more covalent or we can say which one is less ionic So let's compare this NaCl and NaBr and now we can say that cation is same in both so now the covalent nature will be depends upon the anion right and what are the anions here chloride ion and bromide ion among these the one which has the larger anion would be the more covalent then we know that the radius of bromide ion is greater than chloride ion so that means bromide ion is more in size than the chloride ion and the rule says that if a compound is to be a covalent there must be large anion and small cation present in that compound so as per our fajans rule nabr is more covalent so let's take one more example that is sodium bromide and potassium bromide in these two compounds we can see anion is common so the covalent nature will depends upon cation and we know that potassium ion is larger than sodium ion so as per fajans rule the compound which contains the smaller cation would be a more covalent in nature right so here sodium bromide would be more covalent in nature so this is all about fajans rule simply this fajans rule deals with the whether given compound is a more ionic or a covalent in nature so for that you just have to remember that whatever the compound for being more covalent there should be larger anion and smaller cation while for being ionic it just a reverse case that means there should be a smaller anion and larger cation that's it